Osiem, Inhoth, Quichtal, Quishaman, Inhoth, Scotmish Ochomel, Inhoth, Skach Astomoch, and Sequalia Solem, to my quitsy quitstachem. I'm Elder Dennis Joseph from the Squamish Nation. I bring warm greetings on behalf of our matriarchs and patriarchs, especially those of the Coast Salish. Grateful and thankful for Sequalia. The song I'm about to share with you is six generations old. And I heard this song growing up and I have the kind permission of Sequalia Solem, our namesake, who uh, was gifted this song uh, six generations ago. She was, today's medical description would be a paraplegic. Despondent over her condition, she one day began a heavy cry, and this cry was different. As the story goes, her husband noticed uh, this difference and grabbed his drum and began to sing with his wife. In the very beginning of the song, you'll hear a very fast beat on late law, as we call it in the language. And it moves into a steady beat. And when it moves into the steady beat, she had a healing. She got up and she danced. Sequalia passed this song on for all of us to use as a blessing song, as a healing song to help us move on in life. I'm grateful and thankful for today, Sequalia Solem. Her name is Ann Wanak. Sister Sequalia. We share this at many gatherings, especially places like this, to help us move along as families, as friends. Sequalia Solem. And hot. The beginning of the fast beat also represents the thunder that the thunder can come and, and bless us and heal us to help us move along with these miracles that can happen from time to time. Every day, every moment is a miracle. Osia.
Nosiem hoiču, tumakuts kutsēču, and ha squalo. Thanking you for listening to the song, for your kind hearts. <laughs>